Hello everyone let's try to be a cheat code ninja today in this problem we are given two strings s and t and we have to find the minimum number of characters that need to be appended to the end of s so that t becomes a subsequence of s a subsequence means that the elements will be in order but they do not have to be contiguous let's look at the example given for the word coding we can find the letter c o in s but there is no d in s hence all the characters in d i n g will have to be added to s there would be four characters in total let's come up with a solution for this in this example we have to find the subsequence of cat in the word coach hence we will have to go through all the letters in the word coach and try to find the letters of the word cat in order let's try to find the character c in the word coach we'll search in coach from the 0th index we see that the character c is at the 0th index hence c is found now this character c will not be available anymore for comparison and now we have to find the letter a in the remaining letters of the word coach we'll check our current character and check if it is equal to a this is not a hence we'll move on we'll compare the next character and find out that it is indeed a hence we'll try to find the next character in the word cat we'll check in the remaining characters of the word coach for the letter t our current character is not t hence we'll move on similarly the last character h is not t hence we'll move on now we don't have any more characters left in the word coach for all the characters that is remaining in the word cat there is no alternative but to add them at the end of coach the length of the remaining characters would be the length of the word cat minus the current index which is left to be matched in this case it would be 3 minus 2 now let's modify our example so that we can match all the characters of the word cat the first three characters in our word coat is similar to our previous example hence we need to search only t in our word our current character is t and now there are no more characters left in our smaller word hence in this case the answer will be 0 because we don't need to add any more characters to our word the time complexity would be we'll have to go through all the letters in the word s and t so it would be o of m plus n where m and n are their lengths respectively and the space complexity would be constant because we just need two pointers to come up with our solution let's implement our solution we have to keep two pointers to track the characters in s and t let's initialize them to be 0 we'll do our comparison inside a loop if there are characters left in both s and t we'll check if our current character in s is equal to the current character in t in that case we have a match and we have to move both the pointers forward if we don't get a match then we'll try to match the next character in s with the same character in t hence we'll move the pointer of s by 1 at the end our answer will be the number of unmatched characters in t it would be the length of t minus the current pointer of t for the case when there is a complete match the pointer j would be equal to the length of the word t hence the answer would be 0 let's submit our solution as you can see our solution is accepted if this video was helpful please leave a like and subscribe to the channel thanks for watching